Hi guys, so we are starting out with our first of four different demonstrations about properties of air. So I want you to think of it kind of like science magic that's about to begin. And let's put this in context with our unit. We're trying to solve the California drought. Who stole California's water? So we understand now the water cycle well. And just yesterday you should have been um, working on and checking some graph analysis. So you learned that there are four layers of our atmosphere troposphere, stratosphere, mesosphere, and thermosphere. But the weird thing is when we're thinking weather, we really only think about that bottom layer called the troposphere. Um, that's where cloud formation is happening within the water cycle. Um, even the top of Mount Everest is barely into the stratosphere. We also know that's where 90% of the air molecules are. That's the real high pressure area. So when we are learning about um, properties of air, it really has to do very much with what's happening in that bottom layer, the air we breathe and the spot where our clouds form. So today I'm gonna to be showing you four demonstrations on four different videos and after each one, you'll pause and answer a couple of questions about it. The questions are usually this, what did Mrs. Ficus do? What was the result? And then finally, you're gonna to have to come up with what property of air it shows. Now, another word for property in science is basically like a trait or characteristic. So here comes the first demo, the first science magic. So I have here just a clear beaker and I'm going over to my paper towel rack. And I'm gonna take a wad of these paper towels. I'm shoving it down like this into the bottom of the beaker. Now I'm gonna adjust my camera here so you can see what happens. I have a tub of water, and now this is an important step. I'm gonna go straight down into the tub of water, not sideways. Here we go, demo one. So I went straight down in. Now I bring it back out, and you might even be able to hear the science magic. Okay, what we can see here is that we have a dry paper towel. So now tackle those next three questions and then there'll be a new link for demo two.